Okay, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft, Triple X Hardcore Minecraft, where I'm building a castle in the sky. Today I'm going to go ahead and give an update as to what's going on, and then show a couple of speed up videos of me gathering materials and whatnot. So, for example, I've been expanding the land. I did run out of dirt, so I will have to return to the Mesa biome, where I've been getting my steady supply of dirt, to finish uh, filling out this little area. I've also have built a couple other spheres, half spheres, uh, made this little area, and then this area over here to kind of make that wall section that I was talking about in the last video. Now to give another update, I've also decided to start growing some cactuses because I want to change some of the, oh yeah, there's a zombie pigment over here. I pushed him over into the water when he came through the portal. But I've been making a cactus farm so I can make some uh, green dye uh, for to make some uh, green stained clay because I want to make another build out of green stained clay. And I think I'm going to set up a small farm for that here in a second, uh, one that can collect it automatically. But to give an update on what's been going on in the cobblestone generator, if you take a look here, it's doing well. Uh, I have a, a little speed up video which I will show here in a little bit, just a short clip of it. But pretty much all I did was stand in front of the generator. I set up a little contraption on my keyboard where I just had a screwdriver sitting on my mouse while I looked on the other monitor, watched a little bit of TV, and played other games. Uh, and when I thought I had a good bit, I had to use about two, maybe three, four full inventories of stone pickaxes because I didn't want to use any other material to blow through or waste. I want to use the iron for other ones, and plus I'm running a little low on iron since I had to use a bunch of hoppers for it. Uh, I still have quite a few hoppers, so what, uh, whatever hopper I had left, I decided to make this uh, efficiency furnace over here. Uh, basically, I set up a double chest up top, filled it with stone. It's not in there anymore. Uh, I guess it's on its last bit. Yeah, it's on its last bit. Put some more over here, and now I made a bunch of charcoal, which I'll go back outside and I'll show you that I've been growing a lot of trees and collecting a lot of wood and converting those into charcoal. I've been using the furnace downstairs underground to actually make the charcoal. And uh, now that I notice these right here, I'm going to put those on. This is the smooth stone I have so far. Um, also, I decided to make a little door back here. So I could take a look to see uh, if the stone's going in correctly, and you can see there's a little bit on top. I did take some stone out to smelt some, uh, but every other chest and hopper around here is filled with cobblestone, which is awesome. It means it's actually working. It's working just fine. And the uh, redstone lamps that are indicating, uh, you know, uh, what tier of chest is actually got cobblestone in it. So let's see here. Oh, and like I said, here's the trees. I've been growing a ton of trees and cutting down a lot of trees. That's why I got plenty of charcoal now to work my furnaces. Plus, I didn't want to use uh, the uh, the actual coal for the moment. Uh, and I still haven't figured out what the next uh, point of this episode would be. I guess I'm going to make uh, just a small little cactus farm. Uh, just still going to consist of the same size, and it's just going to collect a, a few cactuses, it, because like I said, I want to make uh, some stained clay. And I'll probably work a little bit more over here. But as far as designs yet, I have not figured it out, but I'm going to walk around, show a couple full of uh, quick videos and after that I'll just uh, get back to you on what I have in mind to do. So anyway, I'll be back in a second. <laughs>
Okay, so I'm back, and I've decided to come down to the mesa biome and collect some red sand. That way I can put the cactus on the sand. I figured I'd go ahead and use this particular color because, well, I don't see anyone really using a whole lot of red sand. So I'm going to get over here, collect a little bit of this, and then I'm going to collect some normal sand, just to have a different variety. And then when I get back, I'll just work on the small cactus farm real quick. Okay, so here I am. I'm back at the base. I'm over here by the efficiency furnace, the one that's underground. And uh, I got a full stack of sand, a full stack of red sand. And while I was looking at red sand, I found some clay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to throw the sand, smelt that to glass. I'm going to throw all that in and turn that into brick. Because I got plenty of just regular hardened clay. So I think I'm going to use a little bit of brick. And I might add that into my cobblestone generator build. See how it looks. And if it looks right, I'll probably use that in other builds. Kind of give it a crackling, uh, I want to say like Italian villa look. So anyway, I'm going to get right to that and see how it looks. Okay, so now I've just been watching the furnace for a minute, and I saw that the sand has completed, and now it is going ahead and cooking the clay. So we're going to go in here, grab this real quick. I'm going to grab the cactus dye that I did earlier, and also I'm going to grab, uh, here's some clay I got from the mesa biome earlier. I'm going to do a little bit of harden, uh, oh, let's see, I think I want to make a lighter color, wait, I thought I heard something. Oh, okay. This is on pigment. <laughs> All right. Let's see. And it is nighttime, so I'm going to sleep real quick. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use the glass so I can see on the inside. Oh, shoot. Okay. Well, I guess while I'm waiting, this is what I'll do. I'll make some yellow dye. Let's see. I will do... do, 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 do. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, that's right. All right. So I'm still kind of new at this. Well, how do you... Hmm. I can't remember what it took to make a lighter green. Was it bones? We got any bones? Shoot. Alrighty then. Hmm. Ah, here's some bones. Okay. Let me see if it took bones to do this. Oh, I should really figure this out. Ah, okay, okay. So, lime green. There we go. So, let's go ahead and try this. Do lime green and uh, let's get some hardened clay. Okay, got some lime green right there. I'm going to use some regular green. Okay. So here we go. I got the sand. I uh, got some cobblestone. Let me put this over here. Take a quick nap. It's still not nighttime? What the crap? Oh, you know, it must be morning. Yeah, that's what it is. I've been staring at the uh, oven too long, so I didn't know what it was. All right, so I got the glass, got this got the bucket of water that I'll need. Mm, I guess I'll make some half slabs. That'd be great. Okay, yeah. Mm, or do I already have half slabs? Uh, always gotta check. Okay, terrible at this. Alright, so let's go ahead and do, 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 do a little bit of half slabs. This will hold up the sand. Okay. I'm just going to put my food away. Alright. Gosh, the portal's so loud. I can't wait till I actually build my castle so I can actually move everything around. I mean, I got a lot done so far. Just can't wait to get a whole lot more done. See, I'm going to use some of the wood for the flooring. So let's go ahead and put this up. And what we'll do, knock out some of these torches. So I can have some room. I'm just going to put the cactus farm on this side of the build. Uh, it's not it's not for sure going to stay here. It's just temporary. So I can get uh, a little more, ca a little bit more cactuses. And then when I get everything going, I'll just move a bunch of crap around. So this is what I'm going to do. So...
moment, I really don't need a lot of cactus. Or do I? Okay, so what I'm going to do is run back and I'll, uh, I'll get some hardened clay for the frame and then I'll show the finished product. Okay. Okay, so progress update. I have finished the small cactus farm. Uh, now, it's not the most compact size, but I wanted to make it a little bit of bright, a little, little big, kind of chunky. And it looks alright. I'm okay with the green color and everything. It's not as speckled as I thought. Oh, and it just broke a cactus. Oh, there it is. Just got it while recording. It's They broke a cactus and caught it. So it's not going to be super fast or anything, but I'm in no hurry to get a bunch of red, I mean, sorry, uh, green dye. Uh, so while it's doing that, I can run around, work on other projects. Now, here's another thing, though. The brick is done smelting, so I got this idea, like, hey, what if I take the brick and I put it in, like, random spaces in the uh, cobblestone generator? That way it looks like this is, like, a plastered wall that's flaking, that's got a little bit of age on it. And uh, as uh, the plaster falls off, it reveals a brick wall. So let me take a look and see how that looks here. That's not bad. I like that. Here, let me just uh, take a little bit here. And I'm just going to do one random one up there. And we'll do one random one there. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Not, yeah, not bad. Here, let me just... I'm going to make it look a little bit like the bottom's a little more worn. Okay, cool. I like that. I'm going to do this one random hole right here. Nice, nice, nice. So. And, you know, I can live with the inside looking a little like that, so that's okay. Now just little random pieces here and there. Okay. And I'm not going to do the sides a whole lot. I'm, I'm probably not going to see the sides, like, a lot. So, what I'll do, I'll just hop outside this window. Bruh. I'm going to do a little bit of that one right there. Okay. That one right there. Alright. And I might as well just use the rest of this on. Oh, okay, it's the pigman. Every time I hear footsteps, I think there's, like, a creeper walking up on me. I gotta remember the pigman's around. Earlier I thought he left, but I guess he's still hanging out. So let's see here. Okay, that's cool. I'll just put a random one there. And since I'm not using the space, let's do that one right there. Alright, so let's back up a little bit. Not bad, not bad. I kinda like that. I kinda like the that break in texture. And it does give it an older look. I like that. There we go. So I guess at the same time, while I'm collecting some of the uh, hardened clay from the Mesa Bomb, I'll jump in the water and look for that uh, other clay, that nice, nice raw, uncooked clay. Okay, so we got that. That looks fine to me. So what I'm going to do is uh, pause the recording for just a second, look at a couple other things, and then finish off the video with some other, maybe, small project. Alright, so I know I did say I was going to work on another project, but I thought to myself, I'm going to be showing a time-lapse video of me using the cobblestone generator, and a little bit of a time-lapse of me working on the extended land. And I thought, okay, that's enough, because also, I just got done with the uh, small cactus farm right over there. And of course, you can see Bart down there swimming in the pool. So, what I think I'm going to do is just stop off here, and off camera, I'm just going to finish uh, doing the land right across the, pretty much the home hub right on the island but you know what I, here's the thing i'm fed up i'm ready i'm ready to build a castle so what i'm going to do is next time when i'm recording i'm going to have this finished off and i'm going to be start building out towards that direction where i have the cobblestone path into the new land where i will have my castle so that's going to be the next episode thank you for watching so i'll see you next time goodbye goodbye bye, bye. say goodbye bart <laughs>